Support Laneside. Get something cool. Hey everybody and welcome to another edition of Laneside Reviews. As always, I'm the bearded beast, Rob Johnson, joined once again by Scoops Porter. And we're going to take a Laneside to see how today's episode stacks up. All right, guys, here is Wayne Porter, our speed dominant player. He's going to defy house shot. Now, he's oh, playing a hybrid, a shiny wow. hybrid in the in, in, in the, the oil, oil again. Yeah. Well, it's got an act cover stock, but this one's an act hybrid cover stock. Okay, so we saw the act in the prism solid, and yes. that thing had a lot of teeth. Yes, and this one still has teeth. Okay, Yeah. but it's shiny. Yes, well, it's just got a little bit more pearl additive. Additive, okay. To, to, just to give it a little bit more length. So we're seeing that bite that we saw in yeah. the solid with that with that activator composite. Yeah. And now they've added that pearl to make it flip here down lane to add more motion. Y yeah. So you're telling me yeah. Mr. Speed Dominant here this can play a pearl ball? Out of the gate. I like it. Yes. Yes. So this has the same cores we saw, the, the portal core. So yes. Ultra low RG, RG. High differential, high intermediate differential. Yeah. Which is still strong, but Ooh. <laughs> after throwing the solid first uh -huh. and then throwing this one afterwards, uh -huh. I have to say everything they did amazing in in the solid uh -huh. was even better in this ball. Yeah. Just that little bit of additive to give you a little bit more control. Yeah, I it's could just kind of just a little bit more room for error. Yeah, I could see on a house shot yeah. where you don't need the ball to be sl as slow yeah. and where you can open the lanes yeah. up. I could see, yeah. yeah. Like this one, th I mean, we're bowling on a house shot. Yep. So the other ball, it, was, look at it. Woo! it was good. <laughs> and this ball just opened up the lane just about two or three more boards. For, yeah. For me anyways, I think definitely for Wayne, he saw it. Um, he was a lot more happy after throwing the, the, the hybrid. Yep. Um, the pin action too. Just now, I wrong. I can say, without doubt on this, uh, when we re reviewed this, we usually take five shots yeah. to kind of show it off. Um, we completed this ball. Nobody took more than six shots yeah. <laughs> to complete this ball because, I mean, you matched up with it instantly. Yeah. That that the dynamic core gave you more, more carry. carry yeah. Uh, we're able to drill this a little easier because of that that dot technology. Yeah. We can move that pin, pin around. around. And then taking advantage of that traction that that oh, act cover stock yeah. makes. And I mean, one of my other favorite balls was ultra low RG uh -huh. back in the day. So, I mean, to get back to this low, Ooh. extreme low stuff, this is my bread and butter. I want things to roll. But it, it, I think you can get a lot of playability out of this one. Yes. Like a little bit longer. So you can start out if you have to with the solid if it's a really thick shot. Mm -hmm. And then move into this one and probably stay there for a Good yeah. chunk of the block. You know, I know we talk about house shot killers yeah. a lot. I see this as a game one killer. Yeah. When the lanes are oily, you've got that defined friction point. Boom. Look at how that ball yeah. turned. It just, bam. Yeah, you can very easily open up the lane, especially if you have a, a defined friction point. Yeah. Um, whereas the solid might be a little too strong for yeah. some players. But it's this one is same as the solid. Yeah. Gives you that... That traction control, yeah. and controls the pattern, which is something that a lot of companies are going to be doing or this. trying to do um, because with the, the possibility of having a lot of cliff shots out yep. there, um, you got to be able to get the traction in the front and not overhook at the back. Yeah, you so, don't want to overread that friction yeah. down lane. Now, here I am, and you can see I am taking full advantage of that hybrid cover stock. Yeah. <laughs> I've backed my hand out of it. This allows me, um, like you saw with one of the shots – from the solid to move right and kind of it up the pattern yeah i don't have to over hit this yeah. thing now i can move left 100 percent, i can move left and hook this thing but this has enough traction that i can see there you go it's yeah. a hook you can get it Ooh. to slow down to yeah i can get it to get slow, slow down, down in the oil yeah. but i can take advantage of that that cliff down yeah. lane i can throw it to the five board or to the ten board wherever that friction is yeah. 
and just have the ball. Look, yeah. there was no entry angle there, yeah. <laughs> and it still finished over yeah. the 8.9. It's this new ultra low RG core when this act cover stock is putting the ball they've really targeted a motion yeah where they want the ball to hook on the lane and they've hit it um, for you for those of you who are storm people I know talking to my my storm staffer friends when they were watching it when they're looking at it they said this looked like a halo pearl um, now obviously they can't save it better but we yeah know well, dynamic yeah, core or, is going to increase your hitting power. It's got some advantages over the Halo Pearl with a similar ball reaction. Yep. Let's put it that way. I love this. You can see I played that one right up through the yeah. oil, and we've talked about shiny balls Those and oil usually Yeah, deflect. well, exactly, yeah. Because normally you got that skid, and then it, it gets the over-under or the behind-the-head pin yep. or a funny reaction down lane. But oh, that thing is so good. Yeah. Oh, two new balls in the bag. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a show. So until next time, guys, we'll see you lane side.